Hey guys, Dale here, back with some more RimWorld, and we are at this TIE Fighter spot. <laughs> um, caravan's right at, at the TIE Fighter station. Um, it's bigger than we expected, and that's because we have such a high threat level right now. We have two rocket launchers on site. There's 23 of them. Um, we are short two of our Jedi. They're back home recovering, but I guess let's go ahead and move in. Um... Okay, quest available. Let's go ahead and search and destroy. It looks like they're all heading for the same target. Ekmark has come in quick and alone. Uh, are we low on Psy Focus? We're probably pretty low on Psy Focus because we did have to... Uh, we did have an attack uh, up here. Okay, who has that? Zitro, will you jump in? You have the booster pack. Let's jump in right there. Can you jump in right here? Okay, and then go ahead and get this guy. Uh, someone else has a rocket launcher. You, right? Okay, let's jump in right there. Okay, Zitro, get this guy. Okay, Dunja is down. Our, we are getting severely injured here. Okay, Zitro's back in the fight. Okay, they are fleeing, so I wonder if we can just like take some cover up top. They're fleeing they're fleeing this way though, so. Okay, Zitro. Um actually, you guys no more um no more search and destroy. Just head this way. We'll get some cover from the turrets this way. Oh gosh. He really wants to fight the turrets. Okay, just come down and fight the turrets. Dunja, are you bleeding out? Blaster burns. Sell the blaster burns. Okay, you guys are going to be fine. We will unforbid these things. Okay, Zitro. That explosion, not so hot. Looks like you guys are fine, though. Go ahead and take out this next turret. And let's get these guys. Zitro, another explosion. Not bleeding out, though. So we are going to be okay. After you take that out, okay. We have it queued up. The um the damage against structures versus the lightsabers is a little disappointing. I ooh, uh so this is a thing that happens now while we're on quests. They are targeting us, so we are gonna move and Oh no, Dunja, okay, you've gotten up. Where's Selvi? Why don't you carry Selvi and let's make sure that you don't get targeted. Okay, yeah, they were gonna try and bomb Selvi. They did some damage to this TIE fighter for us. Okay, you guys keep moving. Keep moving. You guys keep moving. Uh, move, move, move. Dunja, just like keep moving. You guys attack this one now. Oh, okay. Vols took a hit. Okay, Dunja, just keep moving. Okay. You guys take this one out. Oh my gosh. Okay, great. Specialized limbs. <laughs> um, Dunja, you're still moving. You guys just back off. Okay, come on. Come on. Birthday. Whose birthday? Vera. Oh, no, asthma. Okay. Uh, I wonder if that's something that Arakiri will be able to fix. We'll have to check that out. Okay, come on. 
Uh, Dunja, just keep moving. <gasps> oh, uh... <laughs> Explosions all around. We are fine. We are gonna get out of here. Uh, reform caravan. Let's head home. Except we have all of you guys. We want. We'll take a component. Um, we want your lightsaber, and I guess we'll grab these weapons to smelt down. Travel supplies. Why not all of it? Send. You guys will be home in two days. Health-wise, Selvi is fine. She's got just got a lot of burns, a lot of burns on everyone, and some muscle parasites. Okay, um, birthday, Vera, you have asthma now. Um, Arakiri, uh, revitalize. She does not have enough Psy Focus for it. I think because she's been resting in bed and not meditating, but we'll see if that changes. We did lower our visibility down from public uh, enemy number one <laughs> or public enemy, whatever it's called, to news, which is still um, concerning, but it's definitely a much better place than we were. What is this quest? This is 11 desperate refugees, including a child are approaching. Um, they want to hang out for eight days, 11 refugees uh do we have space that we could make for them hmm huh. I, I was thinking for a moment of just sticking them in the garage but i guess um we are we are kind we are charitable we will give them some space here 11 of them for eight days not eight of them okay so that's like 10 it's probably more than enough space. I guess we will go ahead and accept them and let's restrict them to inside of our walls. So that'll be that. Uh, food wise, let's also restrict them to. We'll make a new meal policy for them. Uh, new, we'll call it guests. Uh, guests can have uh, simple meals. And they can have nutrient paste meals. And you guys are our guests. Oh, guest. Uh, all of you. Okay. Uh, welcome to the colony. Uh, it is. You guys are going to be sleeping on the floor, but, you know, if you're fleeing the Empire, we're here to help. Oh, um. That is, that is a lot of people. Uh, hopefully that does not increase our raids too dramatically. Let's take a look. Our wealth, uh, our wealth's like been steadily climbing, but like pretty stable. You can see this is when like Pantha took off with a big chunk of our wealth in his ship. Uh, but other than that, we, we haven't even gotten back to that peak yet. So that's good news. How long are you guys out? You guys are out for two days. Hopefully Arakiri and Sybil are well rested by then uh, because we have some stuff that we want to take care of um, and we will see if we can get that done today. Okay, Arakiri can cast Revitalize. We'll cast it on Vera. We'll see if that can like fix her asthma. Uh, Arakiri, you are good to go. You have Force Revitalize. We'll see if it ends up regrowing her lungs. Um, it might not, because she has lungs, so I'm not sure if it'll cure it or not. Disease infection. Vols has gotten an infection. That's fine. We have pretty good doctors out there, and they have regular uh, industrial medicine. Okay, our kids are pretty beat up. Our cure is fully healed. Sybil is getting there. Zitro and Dunja have some healing to do, and Selvi is still down, but we did get another quest for a supply depot raid. Um, we're going to take it for the visibility decrease, uh, and I think we'll send our rangers. Vera is down for probably 13 more hours. She is, uh, the asthma is not being cured. Uh, hmm. I think we'll let her heal up. How many rangers do we have? We have five, so maybe we'll send, like, our rangers and a couple rebels. Someone has an orbital bomb bombardment targeter, right? Um, 
it feels like it would be a waste to use that on a supply depot mission. So, yeah, we'll send the rebels out. Actually, we don't even need to wait for Vera if we're going to send rebels as well. Uh, where is this supply depot? It's right there. It's right next to our Jedi. So let's form our caravan. Let's accept. Let's do rangers. You know what? Vera's going to, she'll get up while they're out there. And then let's do rebels. Um, we'll send uh, Hanal maybe not Hanali. She doesn't have a helmet. Uh, Lucia, Toman, Olive Haddad, Kradesh, and Actually, we can send Caitlin, but Haddad and Kradesh are doing a lot of crafting work for us. Uh, they have plenty of food. Um, let's let's switch that over to survival meals, actually. Okay, four days of food. It's only going to be like two days there and back, but just in case we run into any trouble, they will have some extra food to go with them. Okay, so we have most of our forces out in the field. We have an Empire raid, uh, 36 of them. I guess let's go ahead and get to our defensive positions and let's turn these off of hold fire. So let's see what our mortars can do for us. Please do something good. Okay, <laughs> took out like half almost half of them are they intending to breach our walls um they're attacking they intend to breach your walls okay so our defensive positions are gonna be pointless we could just let our mortars go again it will probably destroy some of our walls but actually they're about to fire again oh, oh. so good so good okay you guys are free to go Let's go ahead and uh, unforbid the things. If if anything survived, it looks like some bodies. What are you doing? You are, you've decided still that you are going to continue attacking. So I guess we'll send Arakiri out for you. I see some gold over here survived as well. Oh, and before Arakiri gets out there, we'll hold fire. Uh, Arakiri, where are you? You are right there. Uh, let's speed boost and then search and destroy. Uh, Mike, okay. Took a couple shots at our wall and then has decided to flee late, uh, but I think we're still gonna go take him down. Oh, she's pushing him. There we go. That is great. Okay, one of our caravans has encountered a patrol. It is just seven of them, so not as big as the last patrol that we had. Um, let's go ahead and get people with shield belts, rangers up front. Uh, let's grab you guys, stick you there. Let's grab you guys and stick you there. Uh, okay, rebels, why don't we have you guys come around here? Uh, we split Vera off because I realized she does not have a weapon. Uh, we picked her up while she was unconscious. So we're going to have her meet up with Ezreal's caravan and head back to base. Uh, let's see how this goes. These guys have pretty good range. Um, do any of you guys have a rocket launcher? Yes, I see a rocket launcher right there. We will try and prioritize him when he gets in range. Okay, and then... Ooh, why don't you sneak in there, sneak up there. Ooh, okay, shields are down. That rocket launcher did some work. Okay, you guys pop up here. Rocket launcher is down. Kate, ooh, rocket launcher is not down. Is there another one? Um, yes, there is. And it's on you. Okay, you guys are good to go. Actually, we could pick up one of these weapons and then just assign it to Vera. Um, ooh, she can enter the ambush. That is something that I did not realize. Okay, you guys are not resting. You guys are heading home. Uh, Vera, go ahead and actually we will we'll send you guys back. So reform caravan heading this way. 
uh, items. We'll grab these weapons. It looks like it. Oh, it's just bio coated blasters. I guess Vera's going to be rocking a rocket launcher. Uh, we'll take them to smelt them down. And then back here, we can go gear, right? Yes. And we will give that to Vera. Okay, uh, resting for the night and then on their way home. Is anyone super injured? Like, um, uh, blaster burn, stab scar, blaster burn, blaster burn. Oh, left lung destroyed. Okay, well we can we can regrow these. We also lost a hand. What a what a terrible encounter for them. Okay, we've arrived at the supply depot. Looks like there's two rocket launchers and 15 of these guys. So I do want us to get spread out. Um, let's take the rebels first. Let's get you guys uh, in some positions here. Maybe up there. And you here. And then our rangers, let's move a little bit closer. There's just not very much place for us to take cover, huh? Okay, Ugh, these guys came up on us real quick. Uh, this guy has a flamethrower, which can cause some problems. Okay, rocket launchers, where are they at? There's one. Uh, why don't you guys go ahead and move up a little bit? Okay. You guys take this flamethrower out. And then rocket launcher there. Okay, we've turned them on search and destroy. Okay, so let's get up here. Actually, so we just need to open those up and take the intel out of this, and we are good to go. So you guys are free. Let's unforbid the things. And what are we getting? We got some armor that will smelt down. We are back down to whispers, which is great. Uh, quest complete. Perfect. Um, let's get you guys home. Form caravan. Get here items, weapons, uh, and this stuff. And then we'll take all your supplies, send, you guys will be home in a little over a day. Okay, nearby, Sybil, why don't you contact the rebels? We'll take a look at what whispers actually means. And then I'm just double checking because I wasn't sure if we had any more quests available to us. Um, Whispers is 29. Okay, so plots wise, we have a lot of intel that we need to get in order to do any more plots. Services, available quests, uh, jump pack, intel, I, Imperial Convoy with the Persona Core, intel. That one was 37, this one's 30, 30, 30, 67 um oh this one does not look bad uh oh it costs 27 intel to get the 67 intel so what if we do this guy let's activate that let's check the world it's right down here okay so about 11 folks our jedi are almost healed up i guess dunja silva and bulls is recovering from an infection uh, who else had the infection? Dunja developed immunity. Vols was like right on the edge of it. He um, got up to 91, it looks like. Um, last I looked at him, the infection was at 81 and he was at 90% immunity. So what if we bring everyone but our injured folks? Um, so Leonid, Ezreal, Sybil, Dunja, Zitro, and Arakiri. Let's grab you guys and let's head there straight away. Okay, Vols is down. Uh, Selvi is recovering. Jedi. There we go. And food, what are you guys bringing? Let's bring package survival meals instead because we have those. That's good. 
Okay, we shouldn't run into any more patrols, but we are going to be increasing our visibility once again. Okay, no rocket launchers, but there are 11 troopers here. Let's go ahead and set you guys loose. And Zitro heading in first, immediately one down. Okay. Okay, chasing these guys down. We do not want them giving word back to the Empire, but it looks like Biter here is going to escape. Um, you guys can go ahead and just start destroying those. Um, hopefully they'll get destroyed a little bit quicker this time. I added the demolish tag to the lightsaber weapons, so they should act a little bit more like breach axes. Yes, that that feels much better. Why don't you guys take these out? We'll open this and then we'll scrape whatever intel that we can. Okay, right away. Perfect. Um, you guys are free to scrape the intel, open that loot box, maybe deconstruct these batteries for components, and we will get you guys home. Pods arrived. Um, we are back in the intel game. I think we'll have 44 now, so we should be able to do another plot. Um, I think we're getting really close to time, and I did want to get over here. So... Let's get everyone home, and then we will see what we can do about another one of these outposts, or settlements. Okay, I have a trade ship, and I just realized one of these quests gave us 150 Luciferi, which is completely wild, but you know what? We'll take it. Uh, our Jedi have returned home. We're still waiting on our rangers to get home, so... Uh, hopefully, we will be back up in action very shortly. Okay, we've recruited Jimbo, um, and we've ordered him in, like, based on his shooting skill. So, uh, Aranika is our next best shooter from the Rebels. Uh, we're upgrading her to a Ranger, uh, and we are dying your cloak whatever color we had to make a new one for her i don't know what happened she must have took it off while we were on another map green dark green i guess that green is fine well what if we go lighter on the inside and then lighter with this no that's good but i think there there we go um so unfortunate like we are very low on thrombo for we had so many in the beginning um we have not seen a thrombo in probably a year okay we're running out of time for today so i think the first thing that we'll do tomorrow is uh an assault on one of the empire settlements we have the ability to do um what is it master and apprenticeship between our uh, Jedi here and in the mod settings you can actually configure how many uh, master like how many apprentices a master can have so we've set it to three and we've split the children up evenly uh, the older children will be with Arakiri and the younger children will be with Zitro so where is that button there it is um, oh your psychic level is too high Oh, interesting. Wait, what? Select a pawn with a lower psi casting level. Psi cast. You're at 42. You're at 15. Okay. Oh. I'll have to see what's wrong with our Akiri, and we'll get that fixed, because it looks like it's working with Zitro. But uh, I have gone ahead and renamed them... Uh, Ara Padawan and Zitro Padawan so we can keep track of them and then we can maybe split them up into little squads of four especially for like the smaller missions so I think this will be kind of like our master and apprentice setup we do not you know typically it's just one Padawan per Jedi master but 
you know, we don't know of any other Jedi, and we have six children to train, so this is this is how things have got to be as we kind of like try and keep Jedi traditions alive. Anyhow, thanks for hanging out, you guys, as always. Until next time, have a good one. Bye!